Alright, how's it going guys? Uh, welcome back to another video. Uh, this is going to be just a recap of this past Wednesday's Go Live session. So if you were absent, I'm going to go over with you guys today what we did. So we read this book called What If uh, by Samantha Berger and uh, it was illustrated by Mike Corrado and I thought it was a really good book uh, based on uh, art and all about me. So anyways, I'm going to read it to you guys and I'm going to talk about what we did after it. So uh, let's get going. Alright, here we go. So this book is called What If, and I'm about to read it to you guys right now as a recap. Um, I don't need to read the sleeve, but we'll start from right here. Alright, what if? With a pencil and paper, I write and draw art to create many stories that come from my heart. But what if that pencil one day disappeared? I'd fold up the paper till stories appeared. And what if that paper was no longer there? I'd chisel the table and then carve the chair. And what if there wasn't a chair here at all? I'd chip and I'd peel at the paint on the wall. And what if there wasn't a wall anymore? I might build a story from the boards in the floor. Seven, six, five, four. Without any floor, I could still use the land and sketch out a tail in the dirt with my hand. I could still shape the leaves. I could still sculpt the snow. I could still plant the flowers and make kingdoms grow. Without any land, I would still use the light, invent shadow stories, and the sun would ignite. If there was no light, I would still use my voice to sing out my stories to, uh, to chant and rejoice. I'd still have my body to twist and to bend, to dance out my stories beginning to end. Ooh, here's a fun page. If I had nothing, but still had my mind, there'd always be stories to seek and to find. If I know nothing but one bit of fate. Oh, look how cool this room is. As long as I live, I will always create. As long as I live, I will always create. Oh, look how cool this is. You can like, see in everyone's window. And that's the end of the story. That was really fun. All right. Well, that is the book called What If. Um, we read that on Wednesday, and then I addressed some questions such as, what would you do if you wanted to create art, but you weren't allowed to use a pencil and paper? And uh, we got some really interesting answers. We had a lot of examples from the book, which I liked, and a lot of ex examples that people came up with from their imagination, which I really liked as well. But anyways, we went from there, and I addressed the uh, assignment that uh, if they had sidewalk chalk, I would love them to be imagined. Uh, I would like them to be imaginative and uh, draw whatever they would like on sidewalk chalk uh, with on the driveway or on the sidewalk 
Or uh, if they didn't have any of those materials, draw something on a piece of paper and just tape it to the window so everyone can see. We're just trying to make the community more beautiful to, uh, this week. Anyways, that's it for this video. Hope you guys enjoyed it. And I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye-bye.